Hi guys! Um, I just wanted to take some time to share with you, like, the latest, um, craze that I've had lately. <laughs> um, and it's nails. Um, I, like, last year I did, like, the acrylics and, and everything like that, and, um, you know, it just got to the point where it was just chipping like the acrylic was actually chipping off my nails and they weren't staying on right and I was just getting sick of it and I mean after a while it does get expensive I mean let's face it so I ripped them off and it was probably like a week process I literally just like peeled them off it hurt so bad um what are you gonna do so anyway I finally got them off and my nails have finally healed and literally it has been such a struggle for me to get them to heal I think it's been like four or five months since I took them off and now they're finally like just starting to get back into shape um my nails aren't painted but um I gotta figure out a color <laughs> anyway this video is basically going to be about all the new nail polishes that I've bought which ones I like which ones are mm, okay. Um, I've got some cool colors, and um, so let's get started. Um, first of all, I want to say that probably my favorite nail polish brand would have to be OPI. I mean, everyone loves OPI. China Glaze is really good. I have a lot of China Glaze. Um, another one that I found that I've really been liking are the new Revlon ones. Um, I don't know, their formula is just really good, and it just seems to last really long. This little baby, um, a lot, I've heard so many good things about it, and so I just decided to go pick up a bottle of it, and I'm so glad that I did. It's the, um, Sachet Vite Dry Fast Top Coat. This stuff is really good. I really like it. Um, I got my first Essie nail polish. I think it was like last last month, something like that. But anyway, I picked up, um, it's called Damsel in a Dress. It is so pretty, and it's, I mean, what it is in the bottle does not do it justice when it's on your nails. Um, it's just so much prettier on your nails, and, and I really like it. I picked up this color because I've been wanting it for a while, and I just think it is one of the most unusual colors that I've seen in a long time. It's by OPI, and it's called My Private Jet really pretty color um this one i just had to have because of what it stands for this is china glaze for audrey it's like breakfast at tiffany's it's the tiffany blue great color i just had this on my nails and i love it um this is an awesome nude um this is called gray suede by revlon and if you look at it in the bottle, it's got like little tiny, um, it's like a shimmer. But when it's on your nails, it goes on completely opaque. And literally two coats is all you need. Best hollow, um, for like Christmas time, if you just want to dress up your nails, is Fairy Dust by China Glaze. Good color. Um, I know that there's been a lot of talk about Chanel's new polish, the Black Platinum. And this isn't, I mean, like a dupe for it, but I love this color. I think it's great. It's called Steal Her Heart by Revlon. These two colors I bought for summer. I'm very excited. I have not tried these yet, but I'm very excited to. This one is called That Away by China Glaze. And it is like this peachy coral melon color, but it has gold shimmer to it. So I'm so excited to try this. And then this is peachy, which is just an opaque, you know, peach color. Um, this one is Strobe Light by Staley Hansen. This is the Heart as Nails Extreme Wear. Um, I bought this because I, I loved it. And then when I got it home and I was looking at, you know, pictures of it online and everything, saw a lot of people say that this was an exact dupe for OPI's, um, Teenage Dream. It was part of the Katy Perry collection. Really, really pretty color. Um, it looks great. It's very hollow. 
it is a pain to get off. Make sure you have like pure acetone because that was the only thing that would get it off for my nails. This is another very um, color that you don't see every single day. This is called Suzy Skis in the Pyrenees. This is by OPI. And it, when you put it on, it looks black until you get, like, up close to it. And it is, like, um, it's like a gray, like a gray dark blue. It's so pretty. I really like it. These two are really good glitters. These are by Sinful Colors. This gold one is called All About You. And this one is called Queen of Beauty. These are really good glitters. I really like them, but same thing as the strobe light. you got to be careful. Get some acetone to take it off. Um, This is a really good purple. This is called Deep Purple. This is also by Sally Hansen. The Heart is Nails Extreme Wear. Good color. This one I wanted for a while, and I just, I don't know. Like, every time I went to the store, I just never picked it up. Um, but this is called, it's by Rimmel. It's the Lasting uh, Finish Pro, and this is called the Steel Gray. Um, Rimmel actually changed their brushes on these, and I'll show it to you, but it's like, uh. I mean, like, look at that brush. It is very cool, and it makes, I mean, like, it fits into, like, the little grooves. So, good brush. Um, I actually, I want to try this on my toes for summer. But this is called Brisbane, Brisbane Bronze by OPI. Very pretty color. And this is part of the China Glaze Anchors Away collection and this is called First Mate. Um, I was looking for like a really good blue. I think I found it. I'm excited. I haven't tried this one yet so I'm excited about that. And then this one, um, I just picked it up on a whim because I thought it was just absolutely gorgeous. I haven't tried this one yet. I have a lot of doing, a lot of painting my nails to do. Um, but this is by Revlon and this is called Midnight Affair and, um, from what I can tell on pictures online and stuff, what it's in the bottle is not the same as, um, you know, what's on your nails. So, that is my nail polish collection, my latest edition. So, I mean, like I said, I, I've i tried probably like 75% of them, but I still do have a lot of them to try. So, I think I better get busy. Um, but, anyway... Uh, thanks for watching, and I hope you liked it, and I will talk to you all later. Bye.